Yo, what's up everybody? This is Dayton from Killinoy Kennels again. What you guys are going to see today is another Killinoy's customer update video. These are a series of videos we do on our channel of the updates of the dogs that we sell to our customers. And what we're going to do here is we're going to show you guys some footage of the parents of these dogs. And then we're going to show you some footage of this dog as a puppy before it left our kennel. And then we'll show you guys the most updated footage. Right now, what you guys are looking at is the father of the pup that we're going to show you. This is our boy, Killinois Kennels Napoleon. He's a dog that we produced in-house here at the Killinois camp, and he comes from generations and generations of our blood. This boy's been throwing it down when it comes to his litters. He's been producing some really nice dogs. Just wait till you guys see the boy featured in this video. Napoleon has a litter on the ground right now, and we also just did a real nice breeding with this boy, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But that's it for the footage of Napoleon. Now we're gonna go ahead and show you the pup's mother. This is our girl, Attica here, one of the many amazing females that we have on the yard over here at the Killinois camp. Like I've stated in earlier videos, you can't have a successful program as far as when it comes with dogs without nice females and Attica is one of those females. She's been producing really, really nice for us. If you guys wanna see a Attica produce video, let us know in the comments section. But with all that being said, that's right. This boy, Sammy the Bull, that we're gonna show you guys today, he's the litter mate brother to our boy, Killinoy Kennel's Dark Low, as seen here. We currently have pups off of this boy, and our boy Napoleon, like I said earlier. So for anyone that's interested in some nice, extreme American bullies, make sure you guys go check out our channel and get with us and we'll take care of you. But that's it for the footage of our boy Dark Low. Now we're gonna go ahead and show you guys the Napoleon and Attica litter. Here are the Napoleon and Attica pups at two weeks old. That's Dark Low and Sammy the Bull right there together. We got Dark Low on the right and Sammy the Bull right there on the left. I wanna apologize that we haven't been on the channel too much here lately, man. We've been super busy behind the scenes working on some things for our merchandise. As you can see that shirt right there, Mrs. Killinois wearing, we're gonna be having a lot of that stuff becoming available here really soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Here's Sammy the Bull and Dark Low, all bundled up with the Stella and Mr. Bean pups. But look at Sammy the Bull right here, man. That boy was looking even harder than Dark Low. My cousin ended up picking up Sammy the Bull, and now we're gonna go ahead and show you this updated footage. All right, you ready? Wanna go swim? Wanna go swim? Huh, wanna go swim? Wanna go swim? Like I mentioned, my cousin ended up picking up Sammy the Bull. I want to send a big shout out to him for doing such a good job with this boy. But they just recently moved into this property. Real nice house on the river right there. You see where he opened the gate? That's actually up to his back door. So the river comes up pretty high. And Sammy the Bull's out there having a blast Stay. living out there, as you can see, man. This boy's going to be living it up. And, uh, you know, make sure you guys watch this video all the way to the end. You can actually see Sammy the Bull swimming for the first time ever. You better get your butt over here. For those of you the guys that are wondering about Sammy the Bull's tail... He actually had his tail docked when he was a puppy. Sammy the Bull is actually a pet quality dog. He was born with a kink tail. Kinks are a part of the breed. It's something that just comes with the American bullies. Every now and then you'll get a kink tail off the litter. And what we usually do is, is while we're at the vet, when the puppies are born, we'll have the vet go ahead and dock the tail. We do it with them while they're super young. They really don't feel it and they heal up really fast. And the reasons why we do that is, is a kink is just like a little kink in the tail. You know, it's not a really big Stay. thing. It doesn't affect the dog at all. You know what I mean? It just looks okay. better with it docked myself. Some of my partners don't do it. Some of them do. You know what I mean? In my opinion, I'd rather have a dog with a docked tail than a kink tail. But that's just my opinion.
You know, like I said, it doesn't affect the dog at all. And actually, most of the time, the dogs with the kink tails are the best dogs off the litter. Go get a drink now. I just wanted to put that out there for you guys. I didn't want you to think that we're docking them trying to hide anything. That's not the case. We don't dock kink tails trying to hide them. We dock them because it's just a better look and the customer is going to be overall happier with the dog. You know what I mean? And as far as hiding them, there is no benefit to hiding a kink tail dog because you can't show an American bully with a dock tail anyways. So I just wanted to put that out there for you guys. And another reason why I wanted to mention all this stuff in this video is for the haters because you know they want to get on here and have a field day with this situation. We ain't got nothing to hide over here. We don't do nothing but good Give business. And that's why we're up Give front with everybody on every single situation. Like I said, just because this boy has a kink tail or a dock tail doesn't take away that this is a badass dog. Give it to me. I'm gonna throw it a little farther. I'm gonna throw it a little farther. He won't swim. He gets scared. Get it. You can get it. Get it. Get it. Good boy. Good boy. He's swimming for the first time. He wants it bad. Come on. You can get it. Get it. That's the first time he's ever seen him swimming. He don't ever do that. He won't get in the water past touch. He wants it back. Come on. See, you can swim. He's pissed now because it's gone. All right. Look at him. He's loving that shit. Check that shit out. Look at you! Good boy! That was pretty fucking cool. Now you know you can swim. Yeah. Make sure you guys show Sammy the Bull some love in the comment section for his first time swimming. And, you know, maybe we can get my cousin to send us some more updated footage. This boy is going to be swimming like a fish in no time. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Get it. Get that toy. Get that toy. Come on. Go get it. Go get it. Good boy. There you go. All right. Yay. Good boy. Good boy. He'll come back. He'll come back. Good boy. Check him out, he's swimming. Look at him, he's really swimming. Good boy! Good boy! <laughs> he gets scared at first.
Oh my gosh! Get it! Get it! Get it! <laughs> Check him out! All right! Come on! Closer now. He's gonna be proud of himself when he gets it. Oh yeah! <laughs> Good boy! <laughs> Alright! Good boy! Good boy! Well, that's it for the update on Sammy the Bull. We hope you guys liked it. I want to send a huge shout out to my cousin for doing such a good job with this boy. And if you guys want to see more footage of Sammy the Bull, let us know in the comment section. These are some of the American Bully puppies that we'll be having coming available here really soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. We have three different litters of extreme American Bully puppies that will be coming available early June. We'll be releasing the information on the third breeding as well and also the Napoleon and Stella litter. We'll be doing a video on that here really soon. I want to apologize that we haven't uploaded any videos these past couple weeks here, man. We've been super busy behind the scenes. We got a lot of real big things coming up with a lot of merchandise, big things with the dogs, tons of real nice stuff coming up. If you guys are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos or the puppies that we'll have available. And after you guys get done watching this video, make sure you go to our channel and check out some of our other videos we got a lot of real nice american bully content i want to send a huge shout out to all of our subscribers and supporters everybody showing love on the channel hitting that like button comment sharing our videos telling the friends about our channel we just blew past 30,000 subscribers and we couldn't have got there without your guys's help if you watch this video all the way through leave the words killinoy kennels in the comment section and make sure you guys hit that like button Let's shoot for a thousand likes off this video. If we can get a thousand likes off of this video right here, I'll drop the updated video of this boy, Killinoy Kennel's Ace of Spades. If you haven't already, make sure you get over there to Instagram, follow us at Killinoy Kennels, and also follow us at OG Bully Block Radio. Every Tuesday night, 9 p.m. Central Time, me and my partner Kev Green from the BRC Global, we do a live broadcast, we go over topics, answer any questions you might have. They usually make out for some really good lives. So again, make sure you guys get over there to Instagram and follow us. We got a lot of real nice stuff coming up to the channel. We got some merchandise coming. We're working on a real nice studio to do live videos from, real nice breedings new dogs all types of good stuff again i want to send a big shout out to all you guys for the support and thanks for watching we really really appreciate it <laughs>